So this is the 2021 Southampton Boat Show and I'm going to do a quick walk around the show and show you all our stands. I think we've got six stands. Um, so you can see a little insight of what it's going to look like. It's the first boat show we've had for two years. Now I haven't got my pass at the moment so I've got to go and get that and get into some other clothes and then I'll show you around inside here. We've got the English Harbour here and we've got loads more to show you so let's go have a look. So um, we've got the William stand here which we're just finishing to build at this second and I'm a little bit in shock because um, Daz, who's this man here, Hello. has just shown me the new 2022 colours and um, yeah they looked good on a little swatch about this but they now look unbelievable. So I think this is lime, is this lime green? Tonic. This is tonic. This is tonic. I don't know if you can see on the camera it's kind of like uh, it's like really light green, pastel. So it looks really, really fresh. Hope you can see that on the screen. Here we have, what model's this one, Darren? That's the three, four, five. This is the 345. And this has got fuchsia upholstery. Now, I admit it's a love it or hate it. I love bright colors. So I think it looks really, really special. I love the black gel coat as well. We'll do a proper tour of these during the show. The last one I'm absolutely gobsmacked with because um, it's got uh, curry. You, is it you joking? Is it really called curry upholstery? It is curry. curry. Uh, this is curry upholstery. So um, it'd be nice to see um, what you think about this colour scheme in the comments. Um, I think it's growing on me but it's certainly a little bit different. And this model's 325. Now, if you want to buy Williams during the show, you have to come and see this man. And this is Darren from boats.co.uk. So look out for him and he will sell you one of these. And we're here till Sunday night. speak this is the Kawasaki stand and we have got this is the first time Kawasaki has been at the Southampton Boat Show for eight years so we're really proud to be showing Kawasaki jet skis again so we have got the Ultra LX which is about 13,000 we've got the 310 LX so that's 160 horse this is 310 horsepower supercharged uh, we've then got the 310X, which is 310 supercharged again, but it hasn't got the jet sound. Can you see the jet sound there? We'll, we'll, this one's got surround sound, which is very nice. We've then got the classic, if you just come around here, you've got better view. We've got the classic Kawasaki SXR stand-up, 1.5 litre. How many horsepower? 150 horsepower so this is a weapon i think it's eleven thousand pounds but if you come to the show we'll tell you um and this is the two seater 160 lx which is 160 horsepower and this is about how much 13,999. and we have got a lovely kawasaki zh2 as well just to mix it up, we thought we'd show you one of the latest motorbikes and it's got a supercharger. Supercharged, so this is the similar engine to we've got in the jet skis. Um, you can buy the motorbike as well if you want, um, but we're here actually to show you the jet skis. So, I mean, look at them, they look fantastic, don't they? Oh, I want to introduce you to Jake. This is Jake. Hello. So if you want to buy a jet ski at the Southampton Boat Show, this is the man you have to look for. So these are the tattoos and these are his sunglasses. <laughs> so he will be here for the next 10 days till Sunday the 19th.
Okay, so here's the Parker stand down the pontoons. For the first time ever, we have got eight boats, starting with the C63 at 50,000, all the way up to right at the end. Can you see up there? We have got the Parker Monaco at 350,000. And we'll just do a quick walk past and I'll talk you through. This is my favorite. This arrived two days ago. It's a 2022 920 Explorer Max. Can you see it on the... But the best bit about it is it's got twin 250 horsepower Mercuries. So I don't know if you can see those on the screen, but to me, this boat is an absolute winner because it's got loads of deck space and loads of power and a lovely wheelhouse. So if we wander back over and just look at the other models, we have got the uh, Cruiser 800 behind me here with a single Suzuki 350, the 790 Explorer with the 250, we've got the Parker 690 Cruiser, and we have got the 760 Quest. And while we're here, Dan, you have to shout because you haven't got a microphone. Dan is the boat's co-salesman during the show. Introduce yourself, Dan. Hi, I'm Dan. Okay, so Dan's going to be here for the whole show. Dan, how much is this one? Uh, this one's 90,000. 90,000, very reasonable, including VAT? Including VAT. Okay, so you can buy that one for 90,000. We've got the 850 Voyager with a Suzuki 300. And last but not, not least, we have the stunning Monaco. So we're just getting them ready, getting them cleaned, just quickly fixing them, make sure they look nice. And um, these boats will all be on the show for the next 10 days. So eight Parkers, come and have a look. 50,000 to 350,000. <laughs> Okay, so we're on the Princess stand down the pontoons and we've only got five boats on the Princess stand and the reason being is they've all been sold. We've sold all the boats. No, it's not, not true. We have got some boats for 2022 but we haven't got enough boats to show and some models are sold out till 2023 and 2024. This is where I will be during the whole show on the pontoons here. So I'll give you a quick tour of the boats we've got, not a tour, a quick resume of what we've got. Behind me we've got the new Princess S66, which I did a review on the S65 before, so that's a great boat, in fact it's my favourite boat. And then behind me we've got the S62, which is the uh, baby sister to the S66. Uh, another fantastic looking boat, shaft drive again. Um, I will be doing a, a, a in-depth tour during the show of this one. Then behind me, we've got the Foxtrot 55, F55. Again, another shaft drive boat, um, which is uh, a great all-rounder for the family. Um, we will be doing a detailed uh, tour of that one too. Uh, but what's more interesting is what this guy's doing here, which is making the um, signs for the S-Class. So you can see behind the scenes. You're going to be on YouTube. All the skilled craftsmen go into making the stand look perfect. So on behind me, we've got the near penultimate boat, which is the Princess F45. I've already done a, a detailed tour of this boat before. This is on IPS drives. And last but not least, we have a very very pretty boat, which is the new Princess V55 which I did a review of about three weeks ago. So six boats on the stand from the S66, S62, F55, F45 and the V55. Now I know a lot of you will be wanting to see the V40. We have got one nearby. We have also got a V50 nearby. So if there's other boats that you want to look at and buy during the show, we can take you out of the show and show you those boats. Um, and we have got um, those um, very, very close. So um, yeah, a nice showing from Princess. Not our biggest display ever, but it's quality, not quantity. Just thought I'd show you the Princess Hospitality, 
which actually is quite big. And you look, he's got a lovely sign here that he's hiding behind. He doesn't want to be on YouTube. And um, we've got some nice, lovely models here, which are looking beautiful. We've got a kitchen over there that you're not allowed in. The reception desk is there. And this overlooks, if you follow me, overlooks the marina here. And this is where the princess boats are out there. So as you can see, not too far, but it's actually quite a big space. Look, you've got a view over that side. We can have a look at the Sun Sea, because look, we can see, uh, see the competition. Um, I'll be on this stand with my brother Guy throughout the whole show. Um, there's the Sun Seekers. Watch the pot plants. But it's all looking pretty good. So we'll go and have a look at something else now. Okay, so this is the Sea Ray stand, and we have got four boats to show you on the Sea Ray stand, and they are behind me, but they've just been covered up because we've got a few, well, it's sunny at this second, but if you look over there, look, it's quite, it's quite moody. We've got a bit of uh, rain. So we have got the Sea Ray SPX 210. We will take these covers off, don't worry. We've got the SPX 230, and we have got the SDX 270, I love this one. And then, last but not least, we have the Sunsport 230, which is a cuddy cabin, which I have done a review of. Now, um, if you're coming to this stand and you want to see us, then I will grab the camera. You will be meeting the cameraman, doing, Brandon. Guys? Brandon will be here to look after you, look after you on Sea Ray. So we got, you can see in there, that's a blue one. I think the others are all gray. They look absolutely right, yeah. fantastic. So we're down the water, right near the princess stand. So if you want to see Ray, or you want some real fun on boats, then this is the stand to come to. Okay, we've also got two other boats here. They're not on our stand, they're on the SeaTech stand, but we have a reimagined Squadron 42, which is ours, and we've just sold it to a customer. I'm gonna do a detailed tour on this during the show. And then we have got the other boat, which you saw before, which is the Squadron 58. So the Squadron 58, which I've done a video of before. But the whole philosophy behind SeaTag is getting used boats and making them like new again. And these are two of our boats and we're very, very pleased. So we'll give you more detail of that when we do a video of the Squadron 42. They're down here on the water too. So come and have a look because it's pretty jaw dropping to be honest. got to put this where are we got to put this Brandon I have no idea put it on the back of the stand there I thought I was doing a video I didn't realize I was coming to rebuild your stand remote bike son <laughs> give us a, a, a give us a scum it's got a supercharged right if I lift the back up go on then son you lift the back up yeah. come on Oh, this is when your gym pays off, mate. <laughs> All those energy drinks you have. Not anymore, mate. I'm, a, I'm clean. Oh, yeah. You've got to go and lift the back again, son. Can't lift through, mate. Whew. It's lucky it's not hot, isn't it? <laughs> right, go on, in, mate. Up, yeah. Three, two, one. Ah! Yeah, I'm just going to move the wheel. Yeah, mate. go for it. Yeah. <sighs> 
You can see why he didn't bother putting put it in position. Yeah. Are we going to leave it there, do you think? Oh, actually, no, I think, I think at the what, back. Straight? Yeah. I think straight, go on, mate. Okay. Yeah. God! No, no, that's mopeds, mate. This is not a moped. How many mopeds have seen this? This is a super bike. You ain't got a clue, is he? Right, there you go. Let's go forward a bit so in the gap. All right, sorry, mate. We, do, we good? Hi, peanuts. That's all right. We're in. We're in. Ta da! Yeah. <laughs>